The Arabic word imra'a. Imra'a. In isolation, it means woman. But as a mudaf, it means wife. Wife. Imra'a. Another word for wife that's used in the Quran is actually more appropriate for spouse. Zawj. Zawj. Both words are used. Now we find imra'ata nuhin. The wife of Nuh. Imra'ata lutin. The wife of who? وَامْرَأَتُهُ حَمَّالَةَ الْحَطَبِ The wife of Abu Lahab. So, so far we have the wife of Nuh. Good woman or bad woman? It's a pretty bad lady. Wife of Lut? Bad. Wife of Abu Lahab? Terrible, yeah. Pretty bad. Then, امْرَأَتُهُ for امْرَأَ Zakaria. His wife, good or bad? Great. The wife of Fir'aun, Imra'at of Fir'aun, one of the best. So we can't decisively say that when Imra is used, it's only used for bad people. Or we can't say the other way that it's only used for good people either, right? The word zawj, literally the word means pairing. What's the purpose of a pair? A pair is two parts of one thing that go together to make something greater. The, the night and the day are paired and together they make the whole day. Right? The sun and the moon are paired. Right? They're pairs. Now, similarly, man and woman are also a pair. What is the purpose of the pairing of a man and a woman? What's the purpose? There are two functions mainly. The first function is the, create, the excess, the increase of good in a society. When people get married, two people get married, two less people prone to fitna. The second purpose of marriage is human beings won't survive unless we have children. So two functions of marriage, goodness and children. This is the basic, basic functionality of marriage. If either of these are missing, zawj is not used. Let's go revisit these words. The wife of Nuh, was something missing? No good was coming out of that marriage. The wife of Lut, was something missing? Goodness. The wife of Zakaria, angel comes and says, you're gonna have a boy, she says, I can't. What's missing? Children are missing. The wife of Fir'aun, great lady, what's missing? Goodness in the marriage. Compatibility between the husband and wife. And of course, children. Now, the interesting case happens with Zakaria alayhi salam. Allah Azza wa granted him a son. What's his son's name? Yahya alayhi salam. Allah says, وَوَهَبْنَا لَهُ يَحْيَىٰ We granted him Yahya. وَأَصْلَحْنَا لَهُ زَوْجَهُ And we reconcile for him his zawj. Before the child, Allah mentions his wife as what? Imra'a. As soon as the ayah mentions that he had a child, the word for his wife used was zawj. Because that which was missing is not missing anymore. Subhanallah.